Good morning, it's Friday, December 22nd, and yesterday I got my Gyoto hand sanded. Well, I got it finished hand sanding this morning, but I got it all glued on uh, together, hand sanded, buffed. It's looking uh, beautiful. So I will get an edge on this one and get it in stock in the next hour or so. And then I will see if I can get some grind lines done on this. Um, I finished at 120, so it's down to thinness. I just need to uh, figure out the finish. So I'll, I'll probably be polishing this one. Um, I did figure out the handle. Um, so I have the handle kind of assembled, but not glued together yet. So I'll glue some of those pieces together just to make that process a little easier. Um, and then maybe, maybe depending on the day, be able to get it glued up today or tomorrow. We'll see, or not. Here's Daniel with what he's got going on. What's up, y'all? Just to get you caught up with what's going on in my world, I got nothing done. <laughs> I basically uh, got in a small, quick, sharpened refurb. These throwing knives had a bunch of handles that the customer glued on. I melted them off. That's all I got done. Um, it was very busy, so don't let Russell fool you and, and be modest on, on what he got done because he was. we all were pretty busy. He was lucky enough to get behind the grinder probably the most out of all of us yesterday. Um, Plan on today being kind of busy as well, but sharpening is definitely what I have in front of me, especially for this customer, uh, which by the way, shout out to Mike Benoit and his wife, who is now the number one ranked, uh, I believe axe thrower, axe thrower? Knife thrower. Knife thrower in the, um, the States. So shout out to Mar Margie or Marcy? Marcy. 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 Marcy and Mike, a uh, really cool couple that we work with on a regular basis. But. I'm gonna stop there. If I can, I'm gonna get to the things I had yesterday. So if you just wanna flip back to yesterday's episode, that's basically what I'll have for you then. But now we're in our favorite place with our favorite guy, Russell. Woo! And what are we talking about today? Today we're talking about the knife, well, one of the knives Daniel finished two days ago. Right on. And we would love to show you the other one, but it sold yesterday, awesome, because it was so gorgeous. So this Euro is in CPM 154 stainless steel, has the little buffed forge up here and then a nice satin finish. And he used a piece of double dyed box elder, this is pink in blue with that beautiful kind of creamy box elder in there. Uh, you can see Daniel's stamp right there. Uh, and this really is Daniel's go-to Euro design. Um, he's been making this one now for a couple years, uh, all but unchanged. And just nice neutral handle, uh, beautiful ramp down to the blade. Uh, yeah, just right nice, on. nice workhorse. Appreciate that. Well, like always y'all, Feel free to reach out to us however you feel fit. We'll wrap it up here. See you on the next one.